So I am very sorry that I did not upload a video this weekend. I generally post every single Saturday, but unfortunately I wasn't able to get a video up simply because I was not feeling it. I just tried my best to film a video and I was not happy with it. So I was like, I'm not uploading this. And so here we are today and I haven't shown you guys the animals settled in or any updates on them in a while, so I'm going to do that in today's video. Come on, we gotta tell them the updates. First, we have this Sadie Pants. Um, in my last update video, I know I said she went to the vet and everything. Um, she went to the vet again, and she got an x-ray done because she was still like throwing up and not eating. She got an x-ray done, the x-ray was clear. Hi, JJ. Life with two cats. So I was like, okay, I don't know what's wrong. So they gave her an enema. That's not fun. So then we went home and then she still didn't eat. And then the next morning, there was the biggest hairball of our life on my bathroom floor. And then she started eating again. And JJ is eating my lights. Excuse me. What is my life? Oh my gosh. Yeah, you had the biggest hairball of the century and you cost me $500 <laughs> just so you can hork up a big hairball and then be all good after, right? You know I love you. Oh, you give your brother kisses? Yes. So that was Sadie. Um, also, while she was at the vet, uh, the vet did do a, like an examination of her. And when they looked at her mouth, they realized she has a misaligned molar so her molar grew in the wrong spot so it is um digging into her lower gums uh so it is causing her some gingivitis and we're gonna have to get that removed oh my gosh jj what the heck is going on squid me so we're going to have to get that removed uh eventually not right away but eventually we will have to get that tooth pulled so that's fun look at these Two cats. You guys are sitting so nice for one. You guys never sit nice for me. Oh, scatter. Mom's here. Another thing I kept getting asked in my pet room tour is where is Saffron? He's not in the pet room. That is because he's in my desk corner area. Sadie, that Saffron's food dish. I need to fill that up. Stop it. But here is the salty boy. I can assure you he is amazing. He looks like he's going to jump at the camera. So we're just gonna, don't jump at us, please. <laughs> How did I guess that you were gonna do that, mister? But he's doing good other than saltiness. Right, Saffron? Yeah. Oh, I know what you want. You want the catnip. Should we try the catnip with the cats? Let's go outside with the catnip. Sidi. Yeah! Come in! Come in, Gigi. Come on, baby! So before I give them this catnip, I have to show you guys my plants. I have petunias, I have this dude, I have this boy and these petunias. I have a hibiscus. I do know it's not safe for cats. They don't chew it. I have that boy. And we have the succulents, because they're the best. Come. Oh, of course you're gonna roll in the dirt. Yeah. Sadie is having a dirt bath. And JJ seems to just enjoy eating catnip. <laughs> Do you have any reaction besides lick it all up? Are you having fun with that? <laughs> oh my gosh. What are you doing, crazy girl?
Oh my gosh. So if you guys saw my pet room tour, you may notice the room already has changed. I wasn't happy with how Lenny's cage was this way because I couldn't see it on the pet cube and I wanted to be able to see him at night when he was on his wheel. So we moved the cage this way and then we have some picture frames that currently have no pictures in them, but I did hang some of these pictures up. And then I moved the shelves. So there's one there and then one over there. And in the center, I have to get some type of big picture or something like that to put up there. You want cheats? Don't bully your sister. Okay, let me, can I, can I stick my hand, can I, Cleo, I don't even think your face is, guys, everybody back off. I have one treat here. Oh, no. Hun, you're going to get fat if you eat that many. Okay, I want to see a trick. Do a spin. Good job. Okay, do a spin. Spin. We haven't done tricks in a while. There you go. Do you? No! That's for Cleo! No, you can't eat it out of her mouth. Look. You can have this one. Guys are piggies. Yeah, big piggies. You especially. You're a big piggy as well, but not as much. I did have a big question that a lot of people asked in my pet room tour video, and that is, how do your rabbits not chew the carpet? And the rabbits do, okay, are you taking a pee? Oh, I'm sorry, I shouldn't watch you take a pee. <laughs> the rabbits occasionally will chew in certain spots of the carpet, especially this. This is shag carpet. I don't like it at all, but it'll do. Um, so when the rabbits start to find an area that they like to dig or chew at, we put some of these mats down. These are, uh, just seagrass mats. You can also get Timothy mats and I find they work in a good replacement for rabbits who want to chew the carpet, right? Or just get a cheap mat like this to put over top that you don't really care if they chew. Right, Cleo? Are you done peeing now? Now you're eating. Is it good? Yeah, is it good? Look guys, look who's awake. Lenny, are you running in your wheel? <gasps> He's so cute. Look at you. Hi buddy. I don't know if you guys can see, but Lenny has had some hair loss back here. Um, I don't know why, maybe it was the stress of moving, but it is growing back. He does have little short patches of hair growing back. So that's kind of cute. <laughs> But other than that, he is doing okay. Hi, buddy. I did want to try to give him something new today, and that would be some black sprays, because he's never had those. Nanny. There you are, you're so cute. Look how cute you are. You're doing your little grooms. Hello. Hi, you're so cute, Mr. Mister. Are you a Mr. Mister? Oh, did you wink at me? Closer. You're so close. Yay! Oh my goodness. <laughs> what is that? This is the best tasting thing ever. Another thing I did want to tell you guys, um, I'm not sure if some people heard me or not in 
Lenny's introduction video. He is around a year old, unfortunately, so we don't know how much time we have left with Mr. Lenny, but we're going to make his little bit of time fun and awesome. Right? Yeah. And look at you! Just laying all cute with your foot out. Look at your fuzzy butt. Wait a second. This is a different flopped bunny in the exact same position, but with a floppier butt. A flop, I meant to say fluffier. Oh my gosh, I am so tired. Lenny is a really big fan of the sand bath. He likes to go in there and he'll just sit in the back corner and he will eat his seeds. Another thing you guys asked me about is how do you brush uh, Lenny? He does have long fur. Um, so I usually have a little slicker brush here and this is just for the ends of her his coat and I just lightly go over them just to get all that bedding out and any mats so when he doesn't really mind it too much and it makes his fur nice and soft and prevents any matting right buddy so another one of Lenny's favorite treats is these dehydrated pear pieces <laughs> Lenny how are we gonna see you did you like that was it good he says I want more give me the pear you didn't finish yours it's still in there mister no you do Lenny so I highly doubt that was enough Lenny footage to satisfy you guys but I am indeed very tired for tonight so I am going to head off to bed and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.